So um, this is today's video and it's a smoky purple look with uh, some nice pinky nude lips and a beautiful like kind of bronzed cheek. Um, during the video I forgot to apply um, some translucent loose powder all over my face and I do recommend you do that. So anyway, stick around, watch my video and I hope you enjoy it. Bye! Okay, so um, I went ahead and applied foundation and the foundation I used was um, Helena Rubinstein's um, Spectacular. Okay, and now I'm going to go ahead and apply the least minute so that it smooths all everything out and gives me like a velvety skin. Like smooth velvety skin. You can apply this underneath your foundation or over it. And today I want, I want it over it. Now that you have your skin nice and smooth, you want to go uh, with a highlighter, a cream highlighter, and this is um, from Bedhead, and it's a um, eyeshadow, and it's like um, pinky champagne color, and it's perfect for the highlights. And I like to put like cream highlighter still when my foundation is wet down the nose okay just here you don't want to go on the tip and maybe here a bit over the lip and then whatever is left just actually put it on the lips okay, then you want to contour your uh, cheeks a bit so just take this is the Rimmel double bronzer just take a bit of both tap it off And you just want to go here in the hollows of your cheek. You can also go down the nose a bit. And a bit on your temples. It's with some Coralista. And I always use it and I really like it, of course. And you just want to go here a bit to give some color. After that, you want to go in Golden Bronze from MAC and you want to apply that all over like here on top of your um, cheekbone so that it gives a really pretty glow mixed in with that. the bedhead, um, the Prince and the Primer. I'm going to take that lighter pinky color and apply it here on the top. Then you want to take another bed head, this is called After Party, and it's a, um, like, a really pretty purple. It's like a more of a cold purple. And you want to apply it all over the lid, and you want to blend it. Okay, um, this is a number 32 MAC brush, and you want to take, um, this is, uh, I think, soft brown, and you want to take some and just go all over the crease of your eye, okay, to blend in with that purple and smooth it out. Then with another brush, this flat dome-shaped brush, this is another color for MAC. I don't remember the name of it, but it's like a, a very um, like lilac color. Very pretty, glycerin kind of. You just want to go in here. And with that same glycerin, you want to go underneath. Make sure you tilt your... No. Then this is another uh, more intense purple, still from MAC, and I still don't know the name of this. And you want to go in like with a 224 with a fluffy brush, take some, and I'm going to concentrate this look mostly in the crease. I tend to try and extend my eye outwards. I'm just going to extend with the lighter colors and with the darker colors. I'm going to start from the outer crease and then concentrate it there and then go inwards and really like accentuate the crease which I usually don't do. I usually 
since I have a more of a cat eye shape, then I tried to extend it even more. But today, okay, now really to accentuate that crease even more, I'm gonna take, this is a um, color from Estee Lauder and it's like a gunshot metal, like very dark um, gray. And I'm going to use a more like um, thin and pointed brush. This is tip, This is just for the crease. And I'm just going to start at the outer corner, concentrate there, bring it back and forth, and then bring it in. Okay, then you want to go in with a fluffier brush and take that lighter uh, color again and just go over in the crease. And maybe also want to um, take a MAC pencil brush and go in with that um, lilac color some more and intensify it here underneath again. That same pencil brush, take that gray, dark gray, and go right at the lash line. Okay, then I'm going to take a dark um, brown pencil and line the inside of my eye. And the top. And also line my eye. Take that same um, pencil brush and just blend everything out. some black gel liner and intensify that line. You just want to tap it right on the lash line. Okay. Keep your eyebrows very natural because you've got such a strong eye. Just brush them out or pencil them in if you don't have any but Try to keep a neutral, natural color. Curl your lashes. Lots of mascara. Okay, so I decided I wanted a bit more uh, purple, so I'm gonna go in with some burgundy from Sisley, just here in the crease, with that fluffier brush. Okay, take some Silver Dusk from MAC and just apply it here to the tops of your cheeks. Okay, uh, for lips, this is a Spice Writer from um, Estee Lauder. I'm going to line, sure, but today I want a more intense look. Then I'm going to take my uh, Helena Rubinstein Wanted Stellars 370. Once I have that nice uh, base, I'm going to take a more pinky, this is the Lip Glaze from Mazayume. Take my finger, you can take a brush obviously, and just apply it in the middle. For an extra pop of light. Okay, and uh, that's your finished look. So, um, I hope you enjoyed it and stick around and watch my other videos. Bye! <laughs>